So I did a little test and uh, I don't know where I read it online, but I, I mixed some a thin set or some concrete, mixed it up, put it on the foam. It didn't stick at all. <clears throat> In fact, it washed off completely. So I set on a little mission to uh, see exactly what worked. So I tried some different things. I did some Mod Podge spackle. Hold on, that cup is bugging me. I got a cup rolling around. So I got some Mod Podge uh, mat, and it put a kind of like a, it's really shiny. Kind of see that in there. It looks okay, but I don't think it was something I would use. It didn't really stiffen it up any anymore. Um, then I tried to mix some thin set and spackle. Once again, that, that was okay. It just, it kind of put a coating on there. I'm sure stuff would stick to it, but it left it kind of soft. And then I tried some thin set and some drywall mud, and it did a little bit better, but not, nothing fantastic. And then finally, I found a recipe online and uh, mix some thin set and latex paint. I did a little bit thicker here. That seemed to work really, really well. That was probably my favorite. It, you could actually hear it. It's pretty hard. That's something that I used on the actual piece that I just did. And right here, I just put plain old thin set. It did okay. Uh, the first the first coat, it's still soft. But once I put a second layer on there, it's, it's pretty hard. But I think my go-to is the latex with a thin set. And uh, the thin set mortar that I used is right here. It's a professional large tile format mortar. And uh, I used the white. It seemed to work really well. Had leftover bags for some tile work that I did. And uh, that's what I put all over this piece that I got drying right now after I put a final coat of clear on there with the polycrylic. So it held up really nice. It didn't make it super, super hard, but uh, I like the overall effect.